Now, speaking of getting high, yeah. you know, not all highs are good highs. Sometimes there are bad highs. Yeah. Do you have a horror high story, a bad experience while you were high? I'm sure. Uh, yeah. So I was in Jamaica, and uh, my friends, there was like 15 of us, all guys, we decided to take brownies one day. And like the crew ranged from guys who smoked weed every day to guys who had never smoked weed in their entire lives. But everyone was, no pun intended, pot committed to taking these brownies. They were like this big. I took one. We all went to the beach and then like all of us were hit with this ridiculous wave to where everybody was, I can't even, like astronomically high. Like I, we, I couldn't even cross the street. Like I was trying to cross the street to go to this pizza place with my two friends and I couldn't, I kept backing up and like, and I finally sat down and we got food and then we ordered buffalo chicken pizza and I was enjoying it and then my friend said like, man, like we gotta get out of here. Like I think like the walls are like coming in and this friend was like a very like, he was like the guy who would get so drunk and not feel it. Like he was like the big type of dude who wouldn't get freaked out. And then he got freaked out, it freaked me out. Then all of a sudden, I just woke up. And what happened was apparently, I woke up on the ground with like 10 Jamaicans standing over me. And my friend said that my eyes started rolling in the back of my head. They thought I was joking. They slapped me in the face and then I fell off. And like, I guess I essentially had like a mini seizure. <laughs> and uh, since then I haven't taken edibles. It was the only time I've taken edibles and I just have, I mean, it ruined edibles for me. I'm not doing it. Oh man, it's crazy. We went to bed at 4 p.m. that day. It was a complete waste of a spring break day in Japan. <laughs>